and welcome to Moonbooks Page One. The title we'll be looking inside today is The Torch of Bridget by Erin Aurelia. I first met Bridget during a Reiki attunement, a ritual process of becoming attuned to perform a form of hands-on energy healing in the blast of the hot healing energy that coursed through my body as my chakras were opened to receive it. What I saw and felt was Bridget's bright flame and its heat charged me like electricity. In that moment, I learned that her fire transforms those who become filled with it. Shortly after that, I became a flame tender for Bridget and have been tending her eternal flame for 20 years. These 20 years have seen several iterations of my life and practice come and go, but Bridget has remained constant through them all. Her burning torch lit and guided my way, and where she led, I followed. I followed her from being one who burned myself out for others, to one who learned to tend her flame from within. I followed her in my spiritual practices, from celebration to devotion, to contemplation, to transformation. I followed her to the traditions of my ancestors and to their well of memory, where they sang their songs to me in new arrangements and asked me to sing them to the world for them. The practice I am sharing in these pages is one such song. I always looked forward to and enjoyed my flame tending vigils. They were times for communication with Bridget, for sitting in and being held by her energy. She both soothed and vitalized me. After many years of tending her flame, I longed for some more frequent, regular practice for communing with her. Not only every 20 days, as run the flame tending vigils, I also craved more regular fellowship with Bridget devotees than I was experiencing in the order I was tending with at the time. If you would like to continue through this book, it is available on our online store, or alternatively, you can ask your local bookstores to order it in for you. Thank you for watching, subscribe for weekly content, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.